Authorities are on heightened alert as nerves remain very tense after those Boston bombings and a number of suspicious packages have been sent to prominent government officials. Some of these packages, according to preliminary tests, contain a deadly poison called ricin. Olivia Stern, she joins us right now, and Olivia, walk us through exactly what this is. Ricin is a toxic that can actually be found in nature. What happens is in the process of turning castor beans into castor oil, it's made from the actual residue of that process. Castor oil used in things like motor oil and laxatives. Now that toxin can be turned into a powder, it can be turned into a tablet, it can even be turned into a mist. The trouble is that there's no antidote to the ricin toxin. There's one company though working on a vaccine for it. It's called Sologenex. It's based in New Jersey. Its shares have surged today more than 20 percent at one point as these headlines crossed of these contaminated letters. It's a penny stock, you know, but four times the average volume of trade versus last year today alone. Understood. Yeah, and and yeah, we should point out as as you just did. It's a penny stock. This is a dollar yeah. sixty-five stock. But four times the average. But volume. four times the average volume, and if there is no other company that's involved, that's significant. How deadly is this poison? Well, it depends how you're exposed. So you can inhale it, you can ingest it, you can even be injected by it. So, for example, the powder here that would be inhaled. That is the least deadly form. The worst case is a, a famous case from the Cold War, which a spy in London was actually wow. injected with a poison tip. Rice and umbrella and killed. All right, thank you.